Today we get to sex all these little baby anacondas. But ow, ow, ow. They are certainly, ow. they are bitey. But the fact is we need to know if they're male or female. Because females are a little bit more sought after. They're also a little bit more expensive. Look at how beautiful they are. It's going to be a bad thing because I've got 40 baby anacondas. And they're going to be biting the heck out of me as I sex them. And basically what I'm doing is averting the hemipenes right here. Just like that. That happens to be a boy. Whew, it's going to be a tough one. I'm going to be a little pin cushion today. There's no doubt about it. Ow! I'm right at the tip of my fingers. Oh my gosh. Little anacons have such big teeth. Another boy. Uh oh. We got two boys and no girl. So far, not starting out the way I wanted to. Dude, I'm getting bit like crazy. Already starting to look at I'm bleed. Oh my gosh. Let's see what we have here. Uh, another boy. Oh my gosh. Let's hope we don't have 40 boys. That would be. Oh, get back in the tub, bud. Get back in the tub. Ow. Oh my goodness gracious. This is absolutely going to be terrible. Three in and I'm already bleeding like crazy. Look at We've got our first female here. Yay. It's a little baby ivy. Look at how. Gorgeous she is, and this one didn't bite me. All right, moving on. Woohoo! Ow! I'm your friend. As soon as I work with these guys a little bit, they're definitely going to be much more docile. Another boy. We're definitely trending in the wrong direction here when it comes to males and females. Like I said, I could turn around. We could roll off five, six, seven females in a row in no time. I sure hope there's a lot more females than males. Another female. What are you doing? You're climbing out, little girl. Come on, little monkey. Maybe all the girls are going to be really tame because I haven't been bit by any of the girls yet. I'm, oh, <laughs> Whoa, this is a little feisty monkey right here. See if this is a boy or a girl. I'm not sure. Ah, oh, we got another girl and it's about to bite me any second. Don't do it. Don't do it. Okay, so we're starting to even up a little bit as far as boys and girls. Like I said, I'm actually hoping that there'll be more girls than boys. But I tell you, I am just over the top happy that I have whatever I have. Another girl. Yay! Look at how beautiful these little monkeys are. I cannot believe that we have 40 baby anacondas. <laughs> Whoop! It's okay. It's okay. Whoa! Whoop, 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 whoop. Come on. Calm down, little monkey. I, I just hate... Oh, my gosh. Look at it. His mouth is just wide open. It's, ow! Ow! Oh, my gosh. What I do for these animals. And like I had mentioned, you roll off a bunch of females in a row. We've got now done four females in a row. Get in there, girl. Don't bite me. Come on. Oh, whoo. Woo. It's a dangerous job, guys. The dangerous job in America right now. Sex and anacondas. Another female. Awesome. We're picking it up. Don't get, get yourself. Get yourself. Ow! Ow! Okay, I'm okay. You know, I promise these guys are gonna mellow out. I'm gonna start handling them because so, you oh might my... ask, what am I gonna do with these right now? I'm actually gonna set them up individually. We're gonna get them feeding. Then we're gonna find homes for the majority of them. As many as I can keep, I possibly can. But it ended up turning out pretty good. Looks like we have one, two, three, four males and six females out of the first 10. Like I told you, sometimes the odds turn around. That's pretty awesome. All right, here comes the next 10. Look at my hands already. Little pin cushions. Oh my gosh. This is a little boy right here. You're a good boy too. Didn't even bite me one time. There you go, little monkey. I am still over the moon excited about the fact that we produce anacondas. I mean, how freaking awesome is that? Another boy. Started both times we started out kind of in the wrong way as far as boy to girl ratio. But we still have a... Ow! What are you doing? Leave me alone. I love you. I love you. I don't want you to bite me anymore. Oh my goodness, that hurts. That's definitely not fun at all. You guys are pretty big and they hurt like you can't believe. Ow! Come on. Come on. Okay, another boy. So far we had one boy and three girls in this batch of 10. Looks like we've got another male here, but at least he didn't bite me, which is good. So far we've sexed about 17 anacondas and I've only been bitten by about 15 of them. Let's get some more females here. Come on, guys. Nope, looks like another little boy. These are little pissed. I tell you what. Okay, here we go. Looks like maybe a girl here. Don't, don't bite me. The more I get bit, the more I don't want to get bit because they do hurt. You know, they're just little babies, but they're big babies. And they really have big teeth for little tiny babies. And again, as I'm sexing these animals out, basically what I'm doing is averting the hemipenes, right? Those little things. Oh, don't you bite me. Don't you do it. Don't you do it. I love you. So what happens is that in the base of the tail, and I think this is actually a boy. So I'll show you, obviously, in the base of the tail, those two little things that popped out, those are hemipenes. Those are the male genitalia. So we've got one more in this batch. I think we're about even, maybe a little bit heavy males on this batch so far. Let's hope we with a female here and we did we are officially 20 anacondas in okay on to the next guys i can just tell it wants to bite me i can just feel it don't do 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 it female that's a good one started out good didn't get bit got a female 
you stay right there. I don't want to get bit anymore, Mama. Please help me. That's a boy. I don't normally mind getting bit, but when you get bit by 40 anacondas, it gets a little old. You get to a point where you're like, okay, I've had enough. I don't want to get bit anymore. Back at you with my friends over at HelloFresh, which only means one thing. I'm going to be eating a really good meal. I'm going to actually be doing Bugagi pork tenderloin. That sounds absolutely amazing. What do you say we get started? HelloFresh delivers fresh quality produce from farm to your door in less than a week so you can savor summer flavors right from your home. Discover seasonal recipes from Taste of Summer series like Old Bay Shrimp and Sausage Boil, Family Style Grilled Steak Lettuce Wraps, and so much more. Foolproof step-by-step -step recipes mean a joyful cooking experience and stress-free summer. Plus, HelloFresh cuts back on time spent in the kitchen with meals ready in about 30 minutes or less. Fit and wholesome recipes make it easy to eat well without sacrificing flavors so you can maintain your goals and feel good about your food choices with HelloFresh. HelloFresh is the first carbon neutral meal kit company and nearly all packaging is recyclable. Also, HelloFresh cuts down on food waste by 25% compared to grocery shopping. Go to HelloFresh.com and use my promo code BRIANB16 for up to 16 free meals and three surprise gifts. And now my favorite part, let's taste it. It smells so good. Mm, that sauce is banging. Of course, you can go over to HelloFresh.com, use my promo code BRIANB16, get up to 16 free meals plus three surprise gifts. And I still have 17 or 18 anacondas to go, so I have a long way to go here, but it's really important to find out what the sex is of these guys so I can figure out who what I want to keep and what I want to sell because it's going to be really important for me to find good homes for these. Not everyone should own a green anaconda. So it's going to be really important for me to... Ow! Whew. All right. I'm good. So it's gonna be really important for me to know. Oh my gosh, it's gonna bite me, I know it. Ow! Okay, okay. Guys, we're almost 30 in. We've got just a handful more to get through the next 10. Whoa! Yep, yep, and that's a boy. Just a few more to go, and then I only have 10 more to go. Okay, come on. Three three more to go. Oh, go, go, oh, Jay Show Boy, it's, it's gonna... Man, I tell you what, I thought these would be tame. I really did. I thought because Ivy is so mellow that these guys would actually be as mellow as the mom. But I was mistaken. After we hand them a little bit, hopefully they're going to mellow out. Okay, we've got a couple more girls. That's good. Good way to end this one. One last one. Come on, be a female and don't bite me. I appreciate you very much. And it's a girl. And look at how beautiful she is. I love you, little monkey. We are officially three quarters of the way through. Only 10 more baby anacondas to sex. I don't know how many more bites. I'm going to probably say 20. You can see they're actually starting to go into blue a little bit. So they're starting to actually go into shed, which means that after that first shed, they're going to absorb the last of the yolk that's in them, and then they're going to hopefully start eating. Now, baby anacondas can sometimes take a while to get started, so sometimes it can take you three, four months to get the animals going, which is just part of what we're going to deal with here. We got another girl, we got another boy before that. So far, I haven't been bitten this time, which is pretty awesome. Ow! In the end, I'll count how many males or females. Got another girl, yay! I'm happy about that. That way we know what the ratio is. Another girl, I'm liking this. But I feel like I've got a thousand needles in my hands right now. Just, oh, okay, okay, okay. Put that one away. Ow! Right in the fingertips. The fingertips are the worst. Uh-oh, another boy. Ow! Got me in the thumb. It's another boy. Got three more to go. Let's have all three of them be females. Please, 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 please. All right, we got one female. That's good. Got two more. Uh-oh, this one looks like it wants to bite. Don't bite, don't bite, don't bite, don't bite. It's just nuzzling up on me right here. Right, here we go. Come on. Be a girl, be a girl, be a girl. Nope, it's a boy. One last baby anaconda sex out. Oh, my gosh. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. And the last one at least is a female. I'll go ahead and count these guys up. Oh, my gosh. I'm like a pink cushion here guys that alone was justice for you breeding and producing i loved every yeah. minute of it Forty thousand anaconda bites that's the paybacks for what you did i'm, I'm will, on cloud nine breeding, look at yeah. these are all little souvenirs <laughs> and i'm so happy for you that you got what you deserved I'm happy to. Time to count these guys. This is going to be a little tricky. All I have to do is count the females because, of course, we know there was 40. We can actually subtract how many females from the 40, and we know what our ratio is. So we, first, we've got one. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to get bit a bunch, too. Two, three, four, five, six, ow, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We got 11 out of the first 20. Now i got to get them back in here. Ow, 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 and it's ouch! Ouch! Ouch, ouch, ouch! Okay, let go, let go, let go, let go, let go, ouch, ouch, ouch! Let's go, let go, let go, okay. 
11 so far. We're doing good. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. It's like that game of monkeys. There's 19, 20, which means we have at least 20 females. So we have 23 females and 17 males. Oh, I'm done, please. Can I stop now? Now I just gotta get these guys all back in. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set these all up individually into their own enclosures. Once I get this done. Okay, here we go. Whew. 23 females, 17 males, not bad. About 100 bites. I still have to set these up individually, so I'm gonna get a bit more. That should be fun. So we're basically setting them up real simple. We want them to kind of be really aesthetic, just till we get them feeding. Then we'll kind of, number one, find homes for them. And number two, we'll move them up to something a little bit more, you know, with bedding and some hides and some climbs. For the meantime, we just really want to get them in here, get them set up. This way we can also start handling them, which is gonna be really important to start calming these guys down. I'm just gonna hopefully gently put each one of them individually in their enclosure. Oh yeah, this is already working out good. Come Come on, up you go. Okay, one down. I'm trying to go with the ones that don't want to bite me. Two down, and I'm putting all the females away first, and then I'll put the males away after that. See, we became friends already, right? I guess you gotta imagine that, number one, they're a little bit like, hey, don't mess with me, I'm still little, stuff like that. They're always gonna calm down with a little bit of age, and actually, I'm trying to avert their hemipenes, so I'm sure they're not happy about that either. It can't be a pleasant thing. It's important to know which males and females, so that, that way I know what I have, number one, and number two, I know when I do find people to take them, they know if they want a male or a female. Couldn't be more happy that we ended up with six more females whoop that one's not happy six more females than we did males so that's pretty awesome i haven't been bit once so let's hope this this trend keeps going i'm gonna be honest my hands hurt right now they definitely are sore from those uh hundred little anaconda bites you gotta remember these snakes still have hundreds of teeth and this size is actually surprisingly painful because they have really kind of powerful bites some snakes when they bite like a ball python it's almost like they like just love tappy or something like that anacondas they seem to mean business i am gonna bite you and you're definitely you're gonna feel this one. It's been a little bit of an injury. Ow! Okay, 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 ow! No, 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 ow, 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 okay, okay. All right, all right, this one's Jay's. I'll mark Jay on this thing right here, okay, Jay? Ooh. Ow! <laughs> Ow, ow, I think it's all right, man. Let's try a different one. That one got me six times. I'm just trying to put you away, bud. Ow, this one got me too. Ow, ow, let go, let go, let go, let go, let go. Ow, ow, ow. That first tub went really well. Second tub didn't start out so well. There's no doubt about that. Oh my God, these are so broke. Whoopsie. It's okay. That if I get a little bit of time with each one of these where I can handle them a bit, I think they're, they're gonna calm down pretty quick. I'm still over the moon. You know, even though I'm getting lit up today, I am loving it, man. This is what I live for. You know, I'm on cloud nine right now playing with baby anacondas. I mean, how freaking awesome is that? We're almost through the females. And with the exception of a couple feisty monkeys, they've actually been pretty good to me. And this way we can monitor for every one that shed. We kept them all together and they started shedding. We wouldn't know which ones shed and which ones didn't. So keeping them individually and in a setting that's really simple, we're gonna be able to really monitor everything about these guys over the next you know month or so as we're getting them eating. So we got the last two females to set up. There you go, little monkey. All in all, not too bad. Let's do the males. Look at that, man. I mean, they're so beautiful. It's just absolutely ridiculous how amazing they are, even if they are biting little monsters right now. <laughs> Look at my hand. Is that just ridiculous? I don't even know what to say. I mean, it's just crazy. It's been a while since I've been bitten as many times in one day. It's probably since I was producing Burmese pythons. Back in the day when I produced Burmese pythons, they're bitey when they're babies like this too. And again, they calm down when they get older as well. But when you're sexing the little baby berms, the same thing happens. You just get lit up with a clutch of 30, 40, 50 of them or something like that. Definitely just part of what you have to go through when you're working with animals like this. But like I said, these guys will tame out. Listen, Ivy is amazingly tame. Jazz was amazingly tame. These are like F5 generation. Should be really strong super docile animals when they get used to people. A little bit of a challenge right now. There you go, guys. Ooh, yeah. Don't do it, don't, no. You know, I don't normally get bite shy, but now I'm kind of bite shy. I'm like, please, no, ow. Ow. Gosh, it got me really in a tender spot right there. Don't do that again, please. Sheesh. We're getting there. We don't have many to go, guys. I'm gonna need a nap after this, I'm not gonna lie. In you go, in you go. Yeehaw. One last stub. Man, I can just come down and play with these guys all the time, you know what I mean? Like, just open up one and just mess with it. I'd like to spend about 40 hours a week just playing with these animals, to be honest with you, because I want them to be absolutely ripping animals. Down to our last four animals, but wait a second. We have five heads? Nope, it's four. And for a second there, I was like, uh-oh, we might have one extra. Oh, look at how beautiful they are. None of them, oh, I do have an extra. So I ended up with one extra animal, which tells me one of two things. Either I had 41, so I'm gonna count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 40. Okay, 
Next thing I'm gonna do is make sure the animal in every tub, just to make sure, because if not, we have 41 baby anacondas. Get in there, buddy. Oh, yep. Yeah. I love you. Guess what, guys? We have 41 baby anacondas. So strike the 40, we actually have 41. So we have 23 females and 18 males. We counted that like three times before and sometimes we're off. Here's our 41st baby anaconda. So we ended up having 41 baby anacondas. I'll be honest, I'm glad that sexing them and setting them up is done. Speaking of done, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, there's a playlist that you can watch all kinds of videos. You can also hit that subscription button. It would mean a lot to me. Also hit that like button while you're down there. Have a wonderful day, Reptile Army. Remember, ow! Ha <laughs> ha